Still a nation. What's going on? It's your guy, Kev Easy here, man. I don't know if y'all know this or not, but Kenny Pickett set Steelers history. He made history. He made history. Breaking Big Ben's record. Y'all want to know a record he broke? He broke the record of having the most completions without an interception. Now, Ben had 207. Before, excuse me, I don't know how much Ben had. Let me, let me not do that. But Kenny Pickett had 208. He threw his 208th pass without an interception. Now, he only threw four interceptions this year, but he don't have too many touchdowns this year. I believe he got six touchdowns, which is pretty crazy for a starting quarterback. You'd have thought he only played like a couple games. Like, this looked good for a running back. Like, not, not look even crazy for a running back. If a running back had 2,000 2, yards, you would think he had about 10 touchdowns. Right now, Kenny got six. But that only, that number's only going to go up the way this offense has been going, man. Um, what do we, My question to y'all is, what do y'all believe this is from? Do y'all feel like this is Kenny's skill, or do you think this is by design? Do you think that he's just playing it safe too much? Y'all let me know in the comments how y'all feel about that. Now, how I feel about that, I feel that Kenny does a good job of not losing the game for you. You know, I feel like he's a game manager now that knows how to click it in to um, the fourth gear <laughs> in the fourth quarter. You know, well, only one of those times where it, it didn't it didn't pan out that way. And guess what? Matt Canna got fired for that. You know, but Kenny Pick has been balling in his last game, and he's been balling as far as not turning the ball over now y'all let me know if y'all feel like kenny is gonna keep this up is kenny gonna go another game without throwing the pick do you feel like his style is gonna allow that to happen or do you feel like this is one of those things where it's like he just got lucky or do you think as long as you keep dumping it to the guys that's wide open he ain't gonna throw no picks because he barely take risks. This last game, he took a few risks, but I felt like it, the risk wasn't too high. You know, the guy, he just knew where to put it, you know, where only the receiver can kind of go get it, man. But shout out to Kenny. You made still his history. There's only so much more history you got to make <laughs> with the Pittsburgh Steelers as far as the quarterback because, you know, Big Ben has most of them, if not all of them, you know. So shout out to Kenny, man. Looking forward to see what you do next. As you can see, it is me. Cavies. So, <laughs> nah, man, but make sure y'all check out Stills for Seven podcast episode 127. It's out right now. It's out right now. It's out right now. Give y'all my predictions on this game and some other stuff. So make sure y'all check that out. It's your man, Kev Easy, man. VSN 2023 was a good one. Shout out to the team. We only going higher from here. Thank you for watching. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit that notification button, and don't forget to follow the podcast on all streaming platforms.